Hello and welcome back to Sean in Belize. Today I'm in the village of Hopkins and that video will come at a later date. But we're gonna stop at an interesting gift shop today, today just outside of the main village, but in Hopkins, Gary Maya gift shop. You'll see it coming into Hopkins or leaving as you come out the city side. So let's go in and take a look. Meet the people. See what they have. Okay, so we're in the Garamaya gift shop. Yeah. And I'm with the owner. Yes, welcome to Garamaya, folks. It's a must visit gift shop. Whenever you're in Belize, the southern Belize of Hopkins, got a beautiful gift shop named Garamaya, where it's 100% free for looking. So remember, when you're in Hopkins, feel free to come check it out because it's free for looking from open to close. Now, explain the name Garamaya. Yeah, the name Garimaya, name Garimaya because I'm Garifuna and my wife is Maya. We both make art and we support our local artists as well. So there you have it. So come to Garimaya, check out some of the artwork. Would you like to show us some of the artwork you were showing yes. me in the other room? We got a lot of nice artworks. Yeah. We have all the leaves and produce when it comes to cocoa chocolate, coconut oil, Marisha product, you know. These are all locally made, locally sourced. All Belizean produce, right? Gotta have your Marie Sharps. Hot sauces. And we have the wood room right here. In the wood room, we have all the native wood that grow in Belize. We have the Zericota, the rosewood, the mahogany, the cedar, the red bullet wood, the cabbage bark, and the purple heart. And we got some underwater lag rosewood. Uh, these are the underwater lag rosewood. So these rosewoods have, have they been just submerged or do they grow in the wood? No, they were wood that fell under the water for years. They take it out, dry it, and make it into something special. Okay. So kind of like the driftwood that you showed me yes, earlier. Just show you some of the driftwood pieces and you can see by the, we got the underwater rough edges. Mahogany. These are mahogany. Rosewood. And the artwork all comes from various artists yeah, around. we have over 70 Belizean artwork in our shop. We support all local artists. So whenever you support Garamaya folks, you support the local economy. There you have it. So this money is going back to the artists, uh, almost like it's on consignment or you yeah. bought it from them. No, what happened, we have this shop built with love and trust. We never have money to buy all these artwork, but right. all the artists have love and trust in us that they know they will get the money. So they keep on bringing their artwork here at Garamaya. It is, it is some amazing artwork. So here you're gonna find pieces that are a little bit different than you're gonna find in normal gift shops. In normal gift shops, you find a lot of the same thing everywhere. Yeah. Here things are a little bit more unique because they're done by local craft hands in their own in their own artistic styles. Yes, so uh, what makes it just a little bit different and unique and worth checking out if you're make in the it real creative. Oh definitely. There's some some beautiful pieces. Yeah we have some paint that jump at you folks come check it out. When you watch the paint, one of them just jump at you because it have the soul connection, you know? Mm -hmm. yeah. We have these here. We got natural jewels. We got the, the rings, the earrings. We got silver and we got brass. Silver and brass. Also locally made. Mm -hmm. 
very pretty pieces. So you're gonna find a lot of Garifuna influence, you're gonna find Mayan influence, yes, sir. and just in general, Belizean culture throughout just about everything in here. You see we got the Belizean soap. We got all the different oils, the cream, you know. The shea butter, we got different. We got all different shot glass, <laughs> out of wood, out of zericote, out of rosewood, out of glass, out of clay. You can get your shot glasses with a with the skull skull eaten by by a jaguar. jaguar. Saw that something similar someplace else like that. And finally, of course, you're gonna have your clothing. Along with all the other artwork. Yes, sir. And in this room, have all the different t-shirt, the Belizean t-shirt, and we get special t-shirt print to promote Hopkins, folks. Hopkins is one of the sweetest Garifuna village in southern Belize. And then you come as a guest, you go back as a family because the people here are so special that you need to come and it worth the while to come check it out, you know? Oh, definitely, definitely. So, the dresses, I know she's bought different dresses here. So, looks like. Yeah. These are the Garifuna gown. These are clothes that my grandmom and my mom go wear. And normally, the Garifuna clothing have two part of it. They have the skirt that come on top of this. Because then, when Garifuna people were on their journey, remember, they were pushed out of St. Vincent. So what happened, they normally, the mother would take off the additional skirt to wrap the child in, to make them warm. Okay. Right? So the clothing is always long clothes where it all over their knee. Serves a purpose. Yes, sir. And you've been open for about 10 years? Yeah, the shop started under my grandmother mango tree. Okay. With me, my wife, and my grandmother making artwork. And what happened is that my grandma says, son, for the dedication and the love you have for what you're doing, you go prosper, you know? So the shop, when I went to name the shop, I would have named it Positive Energy because we all got to be positive. And then um, I say I'll name it Earth Produce, but just before I reach the business registration, I say, you know, I'm Garifuna, my wife is Maya, so the shop get the name Gary Maya. It's a great name. And it's amazing that what started under a mango tree has turned into such an amazing building with so many artists represented and Belizean culture. Yes, so, sir. Thanks for your time. You're welcome, my friend. <laughs> and thanks for having you taking the visit to the Must Visit Gift Shop. It's free for looking from open to close. Check it out. Yes, there you go. If you're in the Hopkins area or anywhere around it, be sure to stop at Garamaya. One love. Yes, sir. All right. Yeah.